zoom in. Do like a really cool zoom. You know what I mean? Like, wee, 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 wee. Back and forth? Yeah. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm Megan Mitchell and I'm here in the Thrive Market Test Kitchen. And today I'm going to show you how to make homemade CBD or hemp gummies. And they're really easy and they're really yummy and I can't wait to show you how to make them. And if you're wondering what Thrive Market is, it's an online market that sells non-GMO and organic products straight to your door. And CBD. They have their own line of CBD, hemp extract. So let me show you how easy this is to make. I'm using two different fruit juices. You can use whatever juice. You could do green juice. You could do orange juice. I'm doing a a citrusy turmeric and I also did a strawberry lemonade because those are the flavors I like but you can play around with whatever you like. I'm gonna demo with this beautiful color. Yeah? Who doesn't want to eat gummies that look like this? I need one cup and this is still cold. It hasn't been sitting out too long. Wait, you gotta make sure it's exactly one cup because I measured this out for my gummy mold so it might be different for yours but mine took exactly Wait a minute, this is measuring cup's weird. So when I look on this side, it says it's that one cup, but when I look at this side, it says it's, I think it's just slanted a bit. Okay, well, one cup. <laughs> and while it's still cold, add three tablespoons of gelatin, and then whisk this together, and then we'll heat this up to dissolve the gelatin. So you always want to add gelatin to something that's cold. It'll start to solidify, as you see, but I want it nice and smooth, so I'm gonna heat it up. <laughs> One tablespoon, my favorite sweetener, maple syrup. You could do um, honey, you could do regular sugar, whatever you like. You can see it's kind of thick. It's not so loose anymore. Okay, I'm gonna pour this in a pot over at the stove, heat it up, and I'll show you how quickly this comes together. Here we are, I guess. <laughs> I never know what to say when we come over here. I'm holding, the, holding some gelatin. This feels weird, but here we are. Okay, so you can see my gelatin is firmed up. Totally fine. We're gonna heat it up and then pour it into our molds. So don't worry if it gets like super, super hard or super gelatinated. Ooh. But that's what it ha that's what happens. This is gelatin. Just scoop it into your pot. <laughs> And then we're gonna heat it up because you can see it's kind of uh, it's not super smooth. I want it smooth. I want my gummies to be just perfection. Okay, bring this up to heat over like medium. You don't want it too high that you're gonna burn it because there is maple syrup in it. So this has already started to melt, but I want to cook it for a total of three to five minutes because I really want to make sure everything has dissolved and there's no clumps of gelatin. I want to let this cool slightly before I add the CBD. If you're wondering, like, I thought you were making CBD gummies, Meg. Where's the CBD? So you don't want to add it to super hot liquid. Um, and also, what are the benefits of CBD? Like, why? What's the big hubbub? Why are people using it? It can help with anxiety. It can help with exercise-induced inflammation. The bonus about using gelatin and the CBD, gelatin's great for your joints. It's good for your belly. You have some stomach issues. CBD also helps support an overall sense of calm, which sometimes I need, you know what I mean? I got a camera in my face all day. I got people yelling at me. I need some calm. Okay, this has melted. I'm gonna let it cool slightly, and then I'll show you how this all comes together. Hi. I just been pacing around the kitchen, cooling down my gelatin mixture. All right, same liquid measuring cup. Pour the mixture right back in there. My molds that I'm using, they're kind of big, which I'm into. Like, I, you know, I want a decent piece when I have a gummy bear. Like, I want it to be substantial. There are 34 gummies in this tray. So I'm doing two gummies per serving. So I need 17 drops of my CBD hemp extract. Math, I did it. Mm. I get really psyched when I do simple, simple math. So I'm gonna have two of these a day for my suggested serving, but kinda you have to do the math with whatever mold you get. All right, that's my spiel about my gummy molds. And it comes with a handy dandy dropper. So this is just warm, 
Remember, I don't want to add my CBD hemp extract to direct heat, like when this is boiling or right on the heat. It might break it down, it might evaporate it, so I want to get full potency when I use this. So warm is okay, cold is okay, but you just don't want this to be super hot. All right, 17 droppers, let's go. One. <laughs> Two. 17. Okay, mix this together, because you can see the hemp extract sitting on the top. So just whisk, 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 whisk. Okay. So I have my gummy mold that I've lightly sprayed. And I have it on a sheet tray because it's a lot easier to put in the fridge than just like this. So put it on a small sheet tray. Mine comes with a dropper. And we're just going to fill these guys. And be careful with uh, spillage over the sides because then your gummy bears will have little weird like <laughs> capes on them. <laughs> so fill them to the top, but don't overfill them. And fill, fill, fill. Remember, I did the turmeric citrus one, but for my, my strawberry and lemonade, it's the same exact process. It's one cup, three tablespoons, 17 drops, 8675309. Her name's Jenny. Give her a call. She's making CBD gummies. I'm just going to top these off. Boop, 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 boop. All right, pop these in the fridge for 20 to 30 minutes until they firm up, and then you can pop them out. I'll show you. It's super easy. My gummies have firmed up for about 30 minutes. See? Da, da, da. Let me pop one out to show you how easy they come out. See, they pop right out thanks to the spray before. Because I actually made them one time without spraying the mold, and they were like, eh, eh, eh. like someone lost a nose. Someone only had one, one ear. This one's paw was a little broken. I was like, oh, got to spray you guys. Keep them in a jar, a container with a tight fitting lid and keep them in your fridge for 17 days and take two a day. And yes, you can take just the dropper once a day if you want, but I think it's kind of fun to take a gummy and maybe you don't like the flavor of that and you get the boost of gelatin. They're sweet, they're fruity. And remember, this is my turmeric citrus. These are my strawberry lemonade. Okay, I'm gonna give this a try. Chewy, like a gummy bear, but has that CBD hemp, lightly sweet, these are delicious. I might have a problem just eating two a day. <laughs> but two a day if you want to stick with the suggested serving amount. I hope you give these a try. And thank you for liking and commenting and subscribing. I do read your comments, so keep them PG. I, I don't want my feelings hurt, but be nice. But you guys usually are, so thank you so much. And let me know if you make these. Let me know if you use CBD hemp extract. And, you know, happy gelatin gummy making. Thanks for watching. I'm about to bite your head off, but you're gonna serve a purpose. I love you. Sit back, dear gummies, Erden. They've, can we not use that? <laughs>